Welcome back to another fictionalhead.com quick tutorial. Uh, today's tip is super quick, but it drives people nuts in Illustrator if they don't know where it is. Um, this tip is when you're dealing with anything in Illustrator that has strokes and you know anything that's set by point size or anything like that, like in this logo here, since this isn't expanded yet, this is set by a stroke width um, of three points. And if I grab this logo, say I'm done with it, but I need to use it in a bigger context, and I bring it over here and I blow it up, all of a sudden my line is super hyphenated now because um, it's still at a stroke width of three, but I just blew it up all this way, but the stroke didn't respond. Um, the easiest, quickest way to fix that is just to right click um, and do transform and scale. And you'll see this option here for scaling strokes and effects. Um, if you check that and then do your scale, it'll actually scale that up. So now that if I check and look, it's 3.6. And if I were to blow this up super huge, um, the stroke blew up with it, which is now 7.8. Um, the cool thing about this is that that setting, although it is in the dialog box there, you don't actually have to use the dialog box to utilize it. So if I know I'm just going to be working on a logo where I'm going to constantly be scaling up and down, you can just do transform, scale. Um, you can leave your scale at 100 and just check or uncheck that box and hit OK. And whether or not that box is checked is going to determine how it works regardless of if you're using the dialog box or not. So if it's checked, the effect will scale. And if it's unchecked, even if I don't do anything with this window, if I just say leave it at 100% but it's unchecked, um, then it's not going to scale. So that's where you need to look if you're having issues with stroke scaling and unscaling. Um, and of course, if you want to just avoid the whole thing altogether, just use expand your stroke uh, to avoid it once you're 100% done. Uh, so that's the tip. If you have any questions, shoot them to me on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and hope it was helpful.